Hello, and we're back. Welcome back to chapter two of Final Six Reverse Recruitment. The emblem <laughs> that transcends time, space, and recruitment conditions. Or so the emblem says. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Chapter two. You got so many units in this chapter. I love it. Why is... Oh, that's a soldier there. Well, rip, rip oh. this cutscene. <laughs> Better skip that cutscene. Yeah, I think I think Milady bugs it out because she yeah. doesn't fly, or she's replaced by someone who doesn't fly, so just quickly skip all the cutscenes. Cutscenes are bad for your health. Okay. Oh my god, you got Merlinus! Oh my god, he joined so early, so... Let's raid him! <laughs> Cast Kong, so 5 me, out of 5 stars! Let me get this backstory out of the way real quick. So, the first version of this patch ever replaced Merlinus with Zeiss, but for some reason, the convoy skill was still tied to this character, so we had <laughs> Convoy Zeiss, or Zeiss, however you want to pronounce it, so he, so had, like, good, he had like a hundred items in his inventory that he could use, I mean... That's amazing! <laughs> it's super overkill, it? I'm very sad that they changed it, but he is Merlinus now, which means we're getting Zeiss soon, but not right now. Soon, uh, TM. Soon. This is Merlinus, I think we also have Ellen now, which is uh, this character, apparently. Oh uh, god, yeah. we'll actually see Hugh used in a Binding Blade Let's Play, yeah. nice. I mean, I guess we could talk about Mernus, he's Convoy, yay. <laughs> cool, yeah. he can he's die. Got a lot of, he's got a lot of skill, which is really good, because he never hits. Are these his vanilla bases, do you remember? Uh, I'm pretty sure, yeah. Okay. So, uh, you is the first mage you get, and probably the best if, like, trends are allowed. I think this is the no first- No, you! <laughs> no, you, no, <laughs> your mom. I think, <laughs> looking at the characters- Oh my god, his mom's there! <laughs> His mom is here, you're right. Also, I think this they is- have a really funny support. She goes like, you fucking disgust me. You fucking anima piece of shit. Get the fuck out of here with the anima really good support. Also, I think this is the first unpromoted unit that joins late. Like, every everyone else before this has been a pre-promote, but this is the first yeah. unpromoted. So as a result, he has, like, kind of good growth. He has... Eh, they're set. not great. He's yeah. got, like, 30% magic. He's got, like, 45% speed. He's got... His defense is really low. I mean, Hugh's got better growth rates than pre-promotes, but they're slightly lower than your average unpromoted. Yeah, he's, like, in between. You're right. He's, like, in between. But, I mean, 45% speed is pretty good, and his bases look pretty yeah. acceptable for me for this point in the game, and my magic is actually really good. I think they're really good. They're so, way better than Hughes, so that's pretty nice. I just yeah. wish he was a pre-promoted sage in Binding Blade. I think it would have fitted him better. I mean, he basically is if you were willing to pay the gold. <laughs> I guess. I guess. Uh, I don't know. It can't be too greedy. I don't. I, don't, I think I'm gonna use you for a little bit. See how he turns out. I think it'll be pretty. Six fine. seven six seven six seven six seven. Yeah, he's. Uh, <laughs> he's like. He's like. He's a devil leveled up once. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> pretty much. He's level two, so that makes yeah. sense. And we're gonna get like four new units, but they're gonna join next turn, so that's cool. In the meantime, yeah. I think usually you want to drop marks on this fort. I don't know if I can do that with you know, because I have less mounts with it. Just put you know there. <laughs> oh, I guess if I kill the soldier, I could just have her fly on top of it. Yeah, that's true. She doesn't get the bonuses, but she, does he need them? Wow, mm, not really. It's more you about know, the void, I guess. Maybe maybe he can kill the soldier if Hugh weakens him. Yeah, pretty sure. Pretty sure Hugh doubles that guy. Seven, so I would need 20 damage total. Wow, you just one rounds this guy straight up. What wow! A boss, what a boss character. Uh, I can't feed anything else to Carol this turn though, so... Gonna, Douglas! Uh, let me see, this is this is pretty good. This is 22, so I would need one more. This is... is it, it's, it's not enough, is it? Seven? Oh, actually, 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 this is perfect, isn't it? Uh, 17. And uh, no, Plus actually, never mind. No, never mind. And he gets that's one of the Yeah, that's some Mang's map tier map there, my cut. Uh, it's late. It's late. It's getting late. All right. Um, Nime maybe. Yeah, um, Nima plus uh, no, Douglas. Douglas did no wait no. Douglas did seven, right? Seventeen. Seventeen. Right? That's yeah. Someone, that's very different. Yeah, it's Karel who does seven. So, yeah, no, no, I don't think this is going to Karel at all. Actually, uh, I think this is gonna. No. Be, I'm just gonna be like, let you show off how good he is. <laughs> <laughs> I was I was just about to say like oh that's this unpromoted pad that I remembered now. <laughs> Join some promoted. Well, <laughs> wow, it's his unpromoted pad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can actually I can toss a javelin and trade with uh, Douglas, but then he gets hand axed and it's kind of annoying. Let's see. Uh, two of these fighters have hand axes, which is really Four, annoying. Five, yeah, he's zero. Yes, yeah, so that's a bit too annoying. Oh, he'll get murdered. Uh, does he get murdered? Eighteen attack. Uh, he survived, maybe? 19... Eight, eight times No, two, I think though. it has the same attack he dies. Yeah. Take that back, Douglas might actually be worse than Boris in this situation, because Boris doesn't get doubled by those guys, I yeah, think. Yeah, true. 
I think zero it's just... speed really sucks. Yeah, turns out having zero of the best stat. Oh wow, <laughs> yeah, he's so broken. I thought Douglas was gonna be kind of good because he's bulky, but he's actually less durable than balls. Wow. It's like that problem that Draug has in FE11, right? Where he just gets doubled straight off the bat after chapter one. He just, it just doesn't, yeah. it just doesn't help. We're trying yeah. all adding damage to the enemy. Super yeah, bad. yeah, and a lot too. Because in in uh, in Shadow Dragon, weapons uh, enemy weapon ranks are so high. Uh, I don't have here they only here they only get one extra damage, which is still annoying, but it's not as bad. Yeah, I don't think I can trade or anything else after trading away the javelin, so I'm just gonna iron sword and wait it out. Yeah, yeah move probably everyone else works a little closer. You gonna go get the armor get the village, as always. <laughs> what, what what was your question? That, I just asked if you were gonna get the armor slayer with yeah, Merlin. So you kind of you kind of answered that yourself. Yeah. Oh look, go for Carol! Ooh, hoo, hoo. good stuff. He can, he can even do it from a foot. Not yeah. that it's gonna matter. He's still gonna die if he misses. Maybe. But if, if, I mean, the last soldier was pretty close to not killing him. He had like two. That might actually be a better kill for Carol. Yeah, we'll see after Yuno moves off. But the thing is, can I make it safe for Carell to take this kill? Because there's a lot of enemies now. I'm curious when you're gonna get your dancer. Uh, pretty soon, I think. Nice plus. Yeah. <laughs> where, where the hell is the type of plus in the Discord chat? Because <laughs> I, I, lo I lost I lost something. I'm, I'm playing with a knife. Okay. And I'm, yeah. <laughs> I shouldn't play with a cool knife. Story. Hey, people. <laughs> Wait, okay, so, so oh, you still get the regular dialogue, right? Yeah. So this is this is Shana's replacements. Ah! <laughs> so, They're not going to Ilya. <laughs> probably not. <laughs> I mean, it, is it is it even better than Vanilla if she joins earlier and then is really bad earlier? Like, <laughs> if you have a really bad character for a longer time, are they really better? <laughs> Philosophical not, questions right here. Not when you got me, man. Here's the thing about Sophia. Everyone goes pitfall, like Pitfall, same class, pitfall. My point is, my, my point is, Nemus gonna give you all the dark magic chip you need, and Nemus probably gonna be better because Sophia. People think she has good growth rates, but she doesn't. Her growth rates are actually really bad, right? She like they, they're not like pre promote tier, but they're super 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 bad. Like at least compared to her her bases, I mean, she has like a. I mean, uh -huh. sure, she's got a lot of magic and resistance, but it's got like a thirty percent speed growth. It's, it's really bad. It's pretty bad for an promote unit. I will say that much. I would like yeah. for, if I'm thinking like super super bad growth. I'm thinking like Yuno and Dion and everything. Sophia is definitely a tier above that, but she's still you know you're right. You would expect a unit that joins that late in vanilla to have a lot better growth. Uh, but yeah. I do think there is a place for having a lot of chip damage to go your way. But the thing about Sophia that I personally hate the most when I try to raise her, God help me, whenever that happens, she has two skill and like bad hit rate and everything. So if the enemy's on terrain, she's just not hitting. And even if, if they no. aren't, it's just so unreliable. So you're right that Nime is going to be a lot more accurate. I think Nime had like 85 hit, whereas Sofia is mm -hmm. probably going to have like 80 at highest, probably more like 70s or something at best. It's going to be pretty. Just to demonstrate good. how bad her bases are, you got to show off like how she gets one shot, probably by characters in the in the second chapter. And keep in mind, this girl is supposed to join in fucking chapter 14. I'll like, tell, I'll do you one better. She gets one shot by this Iron Axe fighter right here. Yeah. <laughs> like that, Even if Sophia it. joined in chapter two, her bases are still bad. Like if that doesn't tell you how shit she is, uh, I don't know. I mean, I think. Uh, but would you agree that even if Nime wasn't here, she would still be shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah okay, yeah, good, yeah. good, good. I, 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 I got the pitfall other way. No, <laughs> you I were like all the a... all the dark magic chip you need. It's like ah, pitfall. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not saying that Nime invalidates her. I'm just. I made a comparison to Nime to make to show off how bad Sophia was in comparison. Okay, but Nime is really good. <laughs> <laughs> she is, but that's why Sophia's bad. Okay, who do you want to go with next? I don't even know who this is. Let's go for the brigand. I don't know who it is, but I want to <laughs> It's <see>. Garrett. <laughs> oh, hi there. Wow, 39. So much <laughs> HP. So much HP. Jesus I Christ. I actually think like um, Vanilla Garrett is actually fairly underrated. People are like... Gonzaga. I actually like him better than Gonzalez in East, which is really weird. But I'll get into that another time. But Garrett... I don't know how good he'll be here, because he doesn't really hold up long term, but these are not stats you would expect on a unit that lasts forever. I mean, the HP is high, and the strength is high, and luck is high, but that's pretty much it. I don't think anything else yeah. about him is really worth it, and like Axe users in general just don't work Very on physics because Axes are bad. Uh, there's some good characters that can use Axes that are like okay, but generally you don't really want to use Axes. But uh, the Berserker class is really good, and the promotion bonus I think is pretty good from Brigand to Berserker. So insane, they get somewhere. like 5 skill, which is crazy. Yeah, it's insane, but Garrett has 25 speed growth. 45 strength growth though, that's higher than I expected. I never look at FE6 pre-promote growth because they don't really matter. 
But wow. No. But that's his only good, good growth though. Like 70 HP and then like everything else is 25 or lower. Like his res growth he is might, 5%. He <laughs> might just cap HP actually. Um, 70%? Yeah. Yeah, possibly. Yeah. Especially if he gets a good promo bonus. Uh, he might still be the best candidate for being on this fort though. <laughs> Looking at all these units I got here. Oh yeah, he's got. He, I don't think he gets doubled by these guys. And he's got 39 HP, so he might be fine. Who's the Vibrant? Uh, I don't know. Was a, I'm saving that one for last. Igrin! Igrin, yes! Is this, yeah! Is this, is this, is this Hi, Igrin! Is this not a favorite of yours just because they're blonde? I like Igrin, actually. She's good. I mean, yeah. what kind of annoys me about Igrin is that little spot on her portrait. I think it's a missing pixel, or it's supposed to be like uh, a birthmark or something? Or what's it called? It might be both, oh. but I have a bit of a sucker for birthmarks. Like the, oh, the little, it's, it's, it's called it's called the model spot. I don't know why, but a lot of models have it. I don't oh, know. It's really weird. What, our official art doesn't have this, though. I think. Maybe it's just a pixel. I, mean, I, I was actually care. arguing about this on a thread with someone. Well, not arguing, like discussing civilly, uh, discussing civilly on the internet. <laughs> discussing civilly yeah. on the internet. It was like sure. people are like, I love, I love Agreen so much. I love the way she works, and she kind of strikes me. She looks a bit like Isadora for some reason. I'm reminded of her. And like, I don't really like that look all that much. I don't think it's very appealing. I don't think it's very, I mean, I'm not attracted to Fire Emblem characters to begin with, but like, I don't know. No. If I think of pretty characters in Fire Emblem, I don't really think of Isadora and Agreen. But I, I can see no, the appeal sort of. No, Igren has a bit of a rough look going on. The, the tan skin on the blonde here looks a bit odd. Uh, I don't know why. Yeah, it's but... not a very appealing palette, I guess. No, I, I, I don't know, and, and and also it doesn't contrast well with her brown attire. Yeah. Like her colors are just a little off. Yeah. In a way. Yeah. You know what yeah, else is off? Her clothes aren't very good. <laughs> She's an archer. Nah, her bases nah. are really good though. Like twelve skills, like that really stands out to me. That she has such high skill. Yeah. And, She's I got mean... like a thirty-five percent strength growth and a thirty-five percent speed growth. It's not great. That's yeah. It says thirty-five strength and thirty-five speed. You're right. Wow. Uh, I'm assuming I, let's assume you actually exactly said that. I wasn't sure if you exactly said that. I, I assume, said that, yeah. Yeah, okay, good. So, actually, you know, if you're going to be an early game archer and you're not, never going to make it to promotion, this is probably the best way to lay out your stats, like just have good bases and mediocre growth, because you're not going to be much of a character long term anyway, right? So you might as well no. have good and bases. No, skill allows her to chip reliably, which is nice. Yeah, I think she can double soldiers at least. Probably not fighters or anything, maybe weight down fighters with steel axes, so that's going to be helpful maybe i'm not sure but um, i don't know probably i don't mind this person early game and then we get a wyvern and when you get wyverns you know things are good that's one of the best things about reverse recruitment patches is you get to play with wyverns very early oh my god this is either size or melody yeah, holy well, shit it's size I mean, it's size it's size it he joins later size. so it has to be size oh my uh, god he's gonna be so good yeah it's gonna be pretty good his speed looks a bit suspect to me actually because he has uh, six base yeah 35 percent speed growth if yeah I that's a bit shaky it's like uh who to compare it to it's like it's like if Dorcas had a good speed growth, I guess, or like yeah. a, a, an average speed growth instead of a bad one. Um, who else would you compare it to? But then he has a, yeah, but then the, the fucker has a 60% strength growth. It's probably going to cap it out, okay. so that's really good. Okay, here's a good comparison. He's, he's like a lot slower than Elliewood. And Elliewood is like shaky speed in FE7. <laughs> that probably tells you like how... He'll definitely struggle doubling, which might hamper him a little bit, but he's still going to be a ridiculously good unit. Yeah, he has 60% strength growth. Uh, only 25% defense though, so his base is good, but it's, it's not going to improve very much. So it's going to no. be, but still going to be decent in the long term, I feel like. And then, I don't know, his HP is pretty high, I guess at 80%, but then the base is like, I don't know, you would expect him to be more ridiculous. I think Milady is better. I think Milady replaces someone who gets hard mode bonuses though. Yeah, keep in mind, normally size has hard mode bonuses, so when you get yeah. him, he's really busted. And those hard mode bonuses, because he comes so late, they're really high. So I think once you strip away those hard mode bonuses, size isn't super impressive. I mean, he's still a flyer. Yeah. But, but he's not as impressive as you think. My, f my favorite part is that he has the same Lance rank as he would have if he joined in Vanilla, which is D. So he's going to be a little bit yeah. better in that regard, at least. Because being, able to, being able to use like Killer Lances in FE6 is a huge deal. If you can't use Killer Lances yeah. when you join, uh, you're so far behind. So Killer Lances have like good hit and the chance to crit and everything. They're not very heavy. So I think yep. that's going to be important. But for now, I mean, Flyer is still really good. Flying is just so, so OP. Flyer Emblem Heroes. Flyer. Exactly, exactly. I like, I don't know, I like this character decently. I don't know if I'm going to be using long term. Probably. Uh, probably one of the better candidates. Anyway, let's see if Garrett can survive here. I mean, Deke can, so Garrett probably can, because he has like... Well, 4 defense is kind of low, actually. <laughs> uh, he's gonna it is really bit. low. Holy shit. Also, oh, I, for a moment I thought he only had a Steel Axe, but he also has, the, has an Iron Axe, so that's good. Uh, let's see. So this guy does like 17. So He really wants a Hand Axe, because most of the soldiers have Javelins. Do you have a Hand Axe that you can give to him? No, I have no Hand Axes. 
In fact, I don't have any other axe users, so... Uh, it's Whoopsie! It's either Iron Axe or Hammer. Well, that choice is clear. I'm just gonna try putting it here with the Iron Axe. Stop! Hammer time! <laughs> Let's see what choice I have. Oh yeah, put Sophia on the fort. I heard she's really good. Yeah, she would survive one hit, which is you know all we need, right? More than I usually see Sophia. <laughs> That's it's like a record. Okay, so how are we making this safe? I know Yuno can one round one of the fighters easily. Uh, Karel can kill the soldier or the fighter, uh, and then someone else can like kill the fighter or the soldier, the other one at range. And I guess we yep. can use Nime and Yu to kill the last one somehow. Uh, I always say Yu. I was like, what? Who am I gonna kill? <laughs> Okay, I guess I'll kill this guy, because he's the toughest to reach, I guess. No, I think this guy's the toughest to reach for everyone in the back, right? Because uh, there's more spots where you can attack the other guy. Yeah. I don't know, I don't know if this oh, matters. Oh, Mecca, you're using up your silver shard early. That's a pitfall. No, pitfall is hoarding. <laughs> <laughs> hoarding is a pitfall. <laughs> don't hoard good items, guys. You need your good items to be used, to, for them to actually be useful. If you're not using you don't really have a choice in Binding Blades early game, to be fair. Yep. Okay, so this is. Oh my place. god! Yep, let's go. He just he just dies. Yeah, well, soon enough he won't die anymore as long as he's on the fort facing weapon triangle advantage. <laughs> I mean, does he die to the soul? I guess you have to kill the soldier, don't you? Yeah, I think he may. Yeah, pretty easily. In fact, let's see. The problem is no one else can come here besides Day and, and Boris. <laughs> I mean, the replacement for Boris. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's pretty much just these. Unless I rescue Karel with. Douglas and then put someone else on a fort. That could also work. How much damage do you do? Um, six. How much damage do you do? <laughs> <laughs> 14. He has 13 damage, so. Oh! Find that pistol <laughs> button. <laughs> That's not a good button for us. Okay. Uh, well, if I kill this guy, it doesn't matter, I guess. As long as I cover. Let's see. Um. That was a bad one. I just rescue Kar. Oh yeah, well you could that you can't use him next turn. Yeah, that's true. Uh, that does well. kind of suck, but it is my safest option. I think just rescue him and then pl place you on the fort. Yeah. 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 No, you on the fort, not me. All right. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Very confusing. This joke's not gonna get old quickly. <laughs> no, not at all. And then we. Uh, yeah, we, we can't drop Corel because everyone else is too lightweight. So we just First time up. I met Hugh, I I I I I, 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 <laughs> I pronounced his name Hug. I was like, okay. you wanna you wanna hug? <laughs> hug, hug, hug. Oh, still getting used to the controls. So, even though I just played a GBA Fire Emblem, I still gotta get used to the controls. <laughs> yeah, so when you when you switch from one Fire Emblem game to the next, you can do some stupid shit every now and then. There are so many enemies concentrated in one spot yeah, on the stupid this map. Maniac mode. This is oh wow. yes, I love axe user duels. <laughs> yeah, they're the best. Did you see that gif I made of like uh, geese fighting in the arena where they just perpetually miss each other? <laughs> uh, I think I did. Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> uh, At least you'll you'll probably one round the soldiers though. Oh wow, nice Ouch. one. I mean, it's fine. It's, it's XP for Yodel because I don't think anyone else got hurt. Yeah, uh, no, no one did. The question is, can anyone chip this guy without you know dying? Oh, I can't kill with Karel anyway, because he's being rescued, so I just kill with you. No you. <laughs> no you. <laughs> That's just the worst. <laughs> this, is good, this is one good reason not to use this guy. <laughs> not to use this guy. <laughs> the puns. The puns, okay. I want to turn off Yodo's animation, at least. <laughs> he's so good, he's huge! <laughs> he's like a self-insert for, for whoever you're talking to. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, Murnus so is bad animations. <laughs> you can't even turn was, them on. <laughs> the first time I discovered this, I was like, yeah, finally, I got to, got to see Merlinus animations. Woo! Advanced rescue oh, drop strats, let's go. Oh, oh, there you go. All that experience lined up for Corral. No, not totally you, it's just Carol. Oh, all right. There you go. <laughs> uh, I guess I got to get my healer over, too. That would be nice. I don't know how Garrett is gonna hold up here. I think you need to. Oh wow! I think you need to place size on the fort, even though he's not. Actually, you know what? Maybe I Gren would be good on the fort. Um, well, that could get her okay. there. I mean, I, I mean, it's, it's way too crowded for Zeus to get overwhelmed by the archer. He's just not gonna reach. I'm just gonna put Zeus here. And did it just? Oh, he doubles the soldier. Okay. I'd be very careful killing these guys with Zeus. Suddenly, I... you're gonna leave, uh, leave room for the archer to come <laughs> he's in. He's not gonna kill anything. I'm just gonna put him here with an iron lance and just gonna wait with these people. 
Right. Uh, that doesn't mean I can't drop the healer though. Actually, I can't because Airgrain is buff. As She's pretty buff actually. Yeah. Uh, how buff are you? Six con. Okay, that's that's good enough for me. Louise size. <laughs> Alright, let's get some generic weapons. I don't even know what I need. Uh, but I have a convoy anyway. It's one of the things I love about FE6 is just having a convoy here. The yeah, you can never really have enough javelins. Well, not an FE7. FE6, they suck, they suck. Like, they have like 55 hit or something. Yeah, it's really bad. It's horrendous. I don't know how many bought. Oh, like two. Probably. Like, 55 hit is just so bad. Even if they have 60 hit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he can't actually crit. He doesn't have enough crit here. Oh, man. This is so much damage. Oof. Yep. Oof. That's really it's okay. Carol is here to uh, hold the fort. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait. Ow! Oof. Stop it! Oof! I don't, is there a hand axe that can reach him? That could be bad. Okay, no, it's fine. Okay, so, um, I guess you know, and then just, the archer still does a lot of damage though, but it's still the best I think. Or <laughs> you know? Actually, <laughs> they and yeah, you know and you, yeah, this is a great <laughs> pairing. I ship it. Uh, hey, kill. <laughs> Sophia so bad. I mean, I want to kill this guy on player phase so that he doesn't, like, suicide on enemy phase, right? Do so, it. Do it. She's gonna... <laughs> this is an amazing sprite, though. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. This. It looks so cool. Yes, I did it. Achievement wow, unlocked. Sophia managed to kill something. Sophia is amazing. I don't know what you're talking you about. You only needed to join 11 chapters earlier. For her to be average. Yeah. 12, actually, for my smell. I mean, did you count Guidance? Uh, yeah, there's 13, actually. So there's one Guidance before 14. One Guidance before 14? There's 12 and there's 8. Oh, two! Sorry, I forgot the one on the Western Your Island. math on Guidance. Okay, so if I kill this guy, I should be sort of... I don't know Isn't if there I'm an okay. Archer there, or are you just... There is an Archer, but, like, who else is gonna do this, right? She's the bulk is unit against everything else, so... Um, maybe they will mm. occupy the spaces? Like, they like to attack from range. This guy's a javelin. The archer oh. might actually... You know what? The archer might actually move first. I've seen this happen a bunch of times. And he'll just kind of place himself between, you know, and Garrett. That'd be nice. I, could, I can't bait him, because uh, no, I only have ranged units don't, in Don't Don't bait him. Just I think he's going to move and get himself stuck, if I know this map well. Because I think ranged units move first in Binding Blade. Okay, well, we're going to go for it. Hurry up, guys. Fighting is happening. Uh, ah, my old bones ache. I'm old. <laughs> I'm old. Oh, no, that guy took his place. He's Actually, Jun you Juno will kill him, so that's good. Yeah. She didn't get strength or anything. She hasn't even leveled up yet. She's just this good. She has nine strength. <laughs> right? Juno good. I never thought I'd see the day. Yeah. I mean, that's one of the cool things I like about this kind of hack. Is, you, know, you get to see oh, that's being good that are never good for you. Really sucks. Um, yeah, I th but she might die to the archer now, maybe? I think so. I think so, because her defenses aren't that great. I mean, he's got an iron bow, so it's not that bad. Oh, please don't double. <laughs> uh, I don't know. <laughs> you never, you can uh, never expect too bad of Sophia, you know. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, that could actually. Nah, she might get no. doubled by a fire. Sorry, yes, kind of double nah. GDFE. Okay, this can probably. Yeah, I think. I don't know. I don't know what to predict here. Yep, she's fine. Look at that. <laughs> totally okay. fine. Totally fine. Yeah, Somehow. iron bows aren't that scary because their might is really low, but steel bows are pretty scary. Yeah, it's like six, so it's like eighteen might. It, I think if she got hit by both of the soldiers, she would have died. Maybe. She's a nice one hit point soldier there for Corral, though. Uh, yeah. The question is, is this a real situation where you want to do that? Because you know, this guy would be in range, and I guess guy could kill all these people here. I got a lot of live units, on the, though. Live on the edge, dude. Uh, no, I tried that last chapter. It didn't work. <laughs> well, dude, you didn't die. <laughs> <laughs> no, not thanks to wow. you. <laughs> My grid's good. Semi good. Um, well, if I kill the archer, it's probably safe to do anything I want, really. Um, I'd uh, definitely have to take care of that guy. Yeah, yeah kill with the art. Yeah, I'm just trying to plan the whole thing ahead, right? So, Karel kill <laughs> this guy. Not the whole plan. thing. Fine. Plan. Plan. <laughs> and then kill this guy with um, Diane. And then kill this guy with um, Igran, I guess. That probably works. Gotta hit a lot of hits, but you know, it'll be fine. BAM! They're fairly accurate for FE6 stats. Are you using your Silver Surf for this? Do you need to do that? Oh, uh, yeah, I think the Javelin might kill, but it has like bad hit. 
I don't have any other weapons for her yet. I guess I could have traded with Z's or something. Right, right, mm -hmm. right. She survives, actually. He survives. Congrats. You would have survived. Ha! <laughs> okay. Look at that. And you did it. This I'm guy proud of you, my God. I'm proud of you. Proud of you. Thank you. Good, good, good for gambling. Good, good, good. Yeah. This guy with uh, Dale, right? And then the last guy with uh, Agren. You gotta gamble a little bit on Binding Blade, after all. <laughs> I mean, that's not what heroes thinks. <laughs> they don't like. <laughs> they don't want to do Binding Blade. <laughs> yeah, they really hate Binding Blade. Holy shit! They They're gonna so get much... like a Binding Blade banner in like 2019 one probably. Sad. <laughs> one day, it's finally. It's been ten thousand years. And it's just gonna be three royals. I'm gonna feed this kill to Zeiss because he's good. You see though? I mean, I guess. I guess he's good. He takes two damage from this guy. Look at him. He's tanky. Did his wyvern always look like that? No. This is his unpromoted palette, remember? <laughs> but, he, but he is unpromoted. I know. That's why I'm asking. Why does it look so weird? Uh, I don't know. It's probably... Who did you replace again? Deke? I think, I think it's so. Deke. Yeah. But does the palette get changed on, based on who they replace? That's really I weird. I think it depends on how you change it when you're at it, making you're making the patch. They probably messed up a little bit when making the patch. I'm not complaining, though, because it looks funny. Um, I guess. I gotta cover Corel with Garrett's, and then I can heal, because no one else here can reach the fort. So, mm. good XP. I think Biting Blade staff users leveling up their staff rank is the worst, because you get, like, I think you get one or two per stat for all stats. I it think it's takes one. for fucking ever to get yeah, men done. And it, you, need 50, so long. you need 50 weapon XP per weapon level for every rank, whereas in FE7, FE for example, you need 30 to get from E to D. So it's, it's much atrocious. better. Atrocious! It's atrocious. And every single weapon and every single staff gives the same amount of weapon XP. Even the Devil Axe only gives one. It's stupid. That's it's why it's fucking bad. bad. That's why Soul's so good. Yeah, yeah, Soul's great. Okay, I'm think... gonna get him. <laughs> uh, not soon, but like we uh, we were gonna talk about this. There's so many units joining early on. Like it's very front loaded. We already like Zeus is from chapter 16. And uh, let's see, who else did we get? Sophia's from 14X, actually. No, 14. And yeah. I think that's the earliest of all these new units, right? I think so. Probably. So, so, like, that's how fast we've gone. We're, like, the last chapter, 20, chapter 24, and we got units from chapter 14 already in chapter 2. So, that shows how front loaded <laughs> FE6 is in this regard. Yeah. It's um, really dumb. Uh, I've been having those decision, decision paralysis, you know, where you're like. <laughs> paralysis, not paralysis. Paralysis is Harry Potter talk. <laughs> decision, decision paralysis. Yeah, I know. I know the feel. Like, I can kill this guy with anyone. <laughs> so many choices. Uh, why can't you use silver swords yet? I think he also... Oh, he's D swords. Okay. So he could use something else if I really wanted to. Probably. Okay, let's get him. Phew! At least this <laughs> boss doesn't have to be killed with the armor slayer anymore. You can just use mages. Oh yeah, fucking Hugh is gonna murder that guy. Oof. I love how he- I, I'm, Does he still say oof? Uh, I can't remember. Boss? He said oof? Yeah, he said oof when he died in the- But I'm not sure if he does- Oh still yeah, does this, is, uh, this is based on the Greenish patch. Actually, this might be the old patch, right? I don't know. Do you recognize uh, no, this it? No, is, this is the new one. This okay. is the new one. It, okay. it just, um... Just check, uh, is Yoder named Yodel or Yoder? Yoder. Yeah, then it's the new one. Yeah. Uh, whatever. I like the new one actually. They use Shana instead of Thaney, so that's good. Um, I mean, I was so used to Thaney, but now I'm just saying. I've Shana. always said I've always said Shana. I don't know why, but I've always said it. Even though Thaney was the original, I always said Shana. Can't explain why I just did. I I can't either. I mean, it's so weird how some names just stick with you, and with others you're like you're, you're super Shana, happy with them. No, there's like so much oomph to that name. I don't know, like <laughs> Shana. I really like it. Shana, 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 Shana. Just gonna put her here, actually, because I'm afraid that you might die to both of these. I don't know how many of these. Some of these. Don't worry, Mac. I'm fine. <laughs> 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 the enemy AI in this part of the map is always like kind of inconsistent for me. I don't know what it is. Yeah, F6, F6 AI is a lot more advanced. I feel like than F F7 AI. They do a lot more weird shit. Uh, I don't know if it's more advanced, but it certainly behaves differently at times. I don't know if advanced is the right word to use. I think the enemies are just good. That's why you think so, maybe. Yeah, so I still have a shot at going to Ilya, even if Sophia gets like no levels. If the units replacing 
Like, if I just don't use the unit, I replace the, the Nomads. I think you go to Ilya if it's a tie. Yeah, that too. But Because like, Ilya's A is a case B, so yeah. I'm pretty but, sure. But Sophia got, like, half you. a level right now, so... Yeah, so you're already going to Ilya. Unless, like, Sue right is... Right now, really my, my status is going to Ilya. Like, like Sue is, like, Percival or something. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> uh, I, I know for a fact that isn't the case. <laughs> Probably not. Mm. Okay, I, yeah, I'm actually kind of fond of Zeiss. I think it's easier to train than Shanna. Shanna's really good. Yeah. Well, I mean, he's gonna become good. It's just really slow. It takes... I mean, six speed isn't like... His basis is decent enough. It's just that he's, he's not gonna improve a whole lot. Don't miss. Thank God. <laughs> 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 Thank whoever the god is in Aleve. Um, do you remember? I think it's uh, St. Alamein, isn't it? Yeah, I think so too. Yeah, that's... Actually, is that the only religion in Alibe? I think there was a discussion support about this at some point. Yeah, I think St. Alamein is the only thing they really worship. There might be something else, but not that I know of. Uh, do you remember if the shop sells fuels or vulneraries? Or just vulneraries? Just vulneraries. Ah, oh, damn. So I gotta be a little bit more conservative with my heal then. <laughs> I, You're I do gonna get, a get next chapter. Um, you can buy heal stage next chapter. There no, a... no, you cannot. Next chapter's the the indoor one. Yeah, where Hector dies. Don't Oops, spoiler. Do not. Um, okay, good. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I know. Yeah, you get a men from the village. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, I think to me, FE seven is like what FE six is to you. Like, I have every single detail of that freaking game memorized. But this game, I'm like, I I've played it. Um, I I've beaten it like less than ten times, basically. Whereas FE seven, I've probably played like twenty times at least. Hmm. Or have you yeah, played FE seven played... more often? No, uh, FE7 I played probably like uh, I don't do eight, this. nine times. <laughs> FE6 I probably played closer to twenty, I think. Because there was a time where I would just chain play FE6 because I was bored. <laughs> I don't know how you can do that though. Like I love FE6. I think it has like great map design, but it's not a game I want to play like many times in a row. I don't know. I really obsessed over it when I was younger. I don't really know why. I really liked its difficulty, so I felt really hardcore when I played it. <laughs> And uh, it was just fun for me. I wanted to use all the characters, so... And I get all the supports, and that takes for fucking ever. That does take literally for fucking ever. But that's not the interesting gameplay, is it? Just getting supports. No, but as I wanted to see everything the game had to offer. Because there fair. wasn't that many guides and shit. So I wanted to see all supports. I wanted to try all, out, out all the characters. I wanted to go both routes. I, I, at first, I didn't really know how you got the routes. I thought it was just random, so... <laughs> I mean, it's like, it's like, it's like a semi-random thing. It's like meant to be random to people until they figure out exactly how it works. But it's... It's meant to be yeah, different could... between playthroughs, basically. You don't... I love route splits, accidental route splits. I wish Fire Emblem would do that more. I'm gonna double check the shelf, because maybe they changed it in the patch. Maybe. Oh, this guy's like, no, nah, I'm not gonna move. Screw you. Ooh, okay. You're not my real dad. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> what? Yeah, I knew they would change it in the patch. Alright, I'm gonna buy uh, like a couple fires then. Wait, okay. So they I, changed I like the... how it costs 420. <laughs> <laughs> Did it always do that? <laughs> Pretty sure it didn't. What the hell? Okay, so they, they actually... They, you should probably visit the armory then if you haven't. Uh, I already visited the armory. They oh, you did. They sold the, the same thing. Yeah. yeah. No, uh, the, the, the Fire Tome and the Binding Blade is actually yes. worth 420. Yes. You got strength, 20%. I'm, I, I missed it because I checked the cost of the Fire Tome, which is 420, <laughs> by the way. What did he get? I got strength on Dion. Oh, I thought you thought it was a Karel level up. <laughs> no, that's coming. That's coming. I like how C's tanks bows in the early game. That's pretty pretty good. Easy. Uh, unfortunately, if I get if I miss though, he dies. So I'm gonna get this to you. <laughs> you I don't need. Here it. you go. Thanks. <laughs> there you go. Considerate of you. <laughs> Appreciate it. I know you have a hard time finding kills because your your skills so not low. Easy. It's not easy. So you know. Hey, it's not that low. <laughs> Is it higher than Sophia's? <laughs> Everyone has higher skill than Sophia. Okay, let's, uh, if I bait this guy into attacking Juno, you know, I think I can get a kill with someone. If it's not Karel, then it's someone else. I'm just trying to feed kills to Sophia, sort of. So, I don't know, so that getting to Ilya is a little bit easier. Like, say I have like a really good character from that goes to, that can go to Ilya, and then another good character that lets me go to uh, Saka. Mm -hmm. Like, the edge on Sophia might make the difference. Oh, come Maybe. on. Maybe. <laughs> If you sit RNG, he's bugged. I did so bad. To be honest, I don't think, like, if she hit, I don't think I could have done it. Yeah, so I need another s sort of weakening thing. Um, Probably, yeah. You. Yeah, you can do it. Thanks, you. I always knew I could do it. <laughs> I always have faith in you, Banks. Um, yeah, I guess we'll go here. 
Are you, like, intentionally taking damage with him or something? Uh, I need to spot where he would go for Corel. I didn't feel like that's oh, right. And I guess it's Yodel XP as well. <laughs> uh, I mean, if I got him, level up, I think. Yeah, yeah he's going. Let's go. I think it's the only one I'm getting this chapter. I think so. Yeah. Okay. Uh, 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 oh, you got two skill and two defense. Uh, yeah, I like it. I'll take it any day. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Should he can he me? kill the boss with the armor slayer? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think. Can he even use it? Is it D in this game? Is it, it D? Is. I think it it's is. It's pretty. Yeah. It's yeah, also, it weighs 11, so he would The have... Armor Slayer <laughs> also got a lot more hit in Binding Blade compared yeah. to FE7. It's one of the only weapons in FE6 that are more accurate in, than in FE7. It's got like 85 hit or something stupid like that. Well, I know Yuno can probably use it, so... You know, I mean, you... You know. Oh, yeah. he did zero. Lovely. You can you actually... Uh, Garrett can just slaughter him with a hammer. Uh, slaughter if he hits, yeah. We'll try. With this, with this 45 hit. How much hit do you think he's going to have? 45? Nah, he's not going to... 45 uh, is the hammer gonna, hit. Uh, let me calculate. He's going to have uh, about uh, 30 hit, I think. Oh, oh he's got more. <laughs> he can, oh, wow. He actually survives two hits. Let's go. Holy shit. Hammer, bro. Curse it all. First, <laughs> First of all. <laughs> Ow. Oh, this is going to take a while. <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Ow, holy shit. Yeah, it's, uh... I mean, I think he will go for you over... Garrett, if I go for that, so... We'll just get the Armor Slayer, see if it works. I think it's way too risky to try with Corel. He probably doesn't have enough hit for me to risk it. Uh, let's see if Nime gets probably one of Probably not, no. She does pretty badly. So it's gonna be you or Garrett if he hits, like, a thousand times, but it's gonna be hard with 40 hit, which is, like, 30 real, I think. So... Yeah, sure. something along those lines. Yeah, this is gonna take for fucking ever. <laughs> He only gets it twice, but it has to be like sort of in quick su succession. Yeah. Let's see. Karel would have 104 minus 30 minus 20. So yeah, not high enough for me to risk it. Uh, so we'll try this and then heal him up. Can't risk it for the biscuit. I mean, I tried risking it for the biscuit and always got killed last chapter. So no thanks. <laughs> <laughs> no thanks. I mean, I guess we can try. Let's go. Why not? Yee. Yee. <laughs> <laughs> this is the game that never ends. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Let's go. Uh, giving 30, 30 avoid to thrones was not a good design decision. This is not a throne though, this is a gate. It only gives 20. Oh, thrones right. Thrones are even worse. Oh yeah, thrones are horrendous. It's okay, you did good. Thanks. You're a good boss you're, you're, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> Huge if true. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> See, greed can only bring you ill fate. That's why you gotta make safe plays. Oh, okay. Let's go. I disagree. Mm, disappointing. My disappointment. Disappointing! Yeah, measured... Okay, I got 11 heals left or something, or like 13. Okay, um, well, we're still on S rank track for tactics. Yay. Woohoo! Caesar. Woohoo! Did it! Roy, Roy, get out of my game! <laughs> go, go to Carol's village, please. <laughs> so that was chapter two. We, uh, we st we're still doing okay. We have no, no amazing fails yet. Yay. Ah, doing pretty well. <laughs> With yeah. Neeman, and Dion, and Yoder. Who'd have thought? Tune in next time when we're getting a good pre-promote. Oh yeah, that's, that's fucking hell. You go With hard mode bonuses. That's gonna be interesting to see, actually. Mm, no, no hard mode bonuses next time. Just, uh... What? Oh fuck, I thought Rutger chapter was like... <laughs> no, no. Next chapter is the chat chapter. <laughs> the chapter. <laughs> the chat the, the chat chapter versus the virgin... Uh... <laughs> I, I hate that meme so much. Bye. I love it. Bye. <laughs>